Google Analytics has released a new feature called Plot Rows, which allows you to interact with the graph that you see in all detail reports to choose which rows to visualize. So if we scroll down here in our Pages and Screens report, you'll see that the top five rows plus this total row are pre-selected. In the graph, you can see the total row is always going to be the one on top with the hashed line. If I want to go ahead and remove that total row so that there's more space on the graph, I can just deselect it and hit plot rows. Now I get a better visual indication of what's going on here. I can select up to five rows at a time. So if I wanted to, for example, remove the home page and add row six here, I can do that and replot my rows and get a better visual of the pages that are being viewed over time on our site. As mentioned, this works in detail reports. So let's hop over to the traffic acquisition report and look at this here. Now the traffic acquisition report will look at the channels that are driving traffic to the site. Now in this case, there's a couple channels that are driving a majority of the traffic. And so some of the smaller channels are not visualized on this graph. If I wanted to, for example, visualize all organic channels in my graph, I could click this box here to deselect all of the boxes currently selected, and then I can go through and choose organic and then hit plot rows. That's great, but as you can see, organic search has significantly higher volume here. So if I wanna remove that and replot my rows, I'll be able to see the smaller volume channels better. Now we can get a good visual indicator of the smaller organic channels driving traffic to our site. As you can see, plot rows is a great feature to be able to more accurately visualize your data to help your analysis efforts.